Hey everyone, welcome to the Tutorial Lab, where we simplify tech tools for everyone. Today, we're diving into ChatGPT, one of the most popular AI tools out there. If you're a fan of using ChatGPT or just curious about it, you've probably wondered, is it worth upgrading to the paid version, ChatGPT Plus? Is that $20 per month investment really worth it? Let's break down the differences, and by the end, you'll know if it's the right choice for you. 1. Overview of versions Let's start by talking about the two options, the free version of ChatGPT and the paid ChatGPT+. Free version. The free version is perfect for casual users or anyone who's new to AI and just wants to experiment. It gives you access to basic AI capabilities so you can ask questions, get help with tasks, and explore what AI can do, all at zero cost. Paid version, ChatGPT+. Now ChatGPT+, the paid version, costs around $20 per month. This option is designed for users who need faster response times and exclusive features, which we'll dive into shortly. So, is it really that much better? Let's find out. 2. Key Differences Alright, let's go through the major differences between the free and paid versions. Performance First up, performance. If you've used the free version, you may have noticed it can be a bit slow during busy times. With ChatGPT+, Plus, you get faster responses, especially when a lot of people are online, so it's ideal for those busy periods. Access to features. Paid users also get priority access to new features, so if OpenAI releases a big update or a cool new tool, plus users are often the first to try it out. User experience. And lastly, the overall experience. While both versions have similar layouts, the paid version may offer a smoother, more efficient workflow for users who rely on ChatGPT for work or study. Real-world testing. Now let's do a real-time comparison. I'll input the same prompt into both versions to see if we notice any differences in response time and quality. As you can see, the paid version responded a bit quicker, and the answer is more refined, which can make a difference if you're looking for accuracy or are on a deadline. Limitations of each version. Now let's be fair and talk about the limitations. Free version. The free version is a solid tool, but it can slow down during peak hours and doesn't offer priority access to new features. So if you're only using it casually, it works well, but it might not be the best choice if you need reliability. Paid version. As for the paid version, while you get faster responses and priority access, it does come with a cost. So, for someone using ChatGPT here and there, paying $20 a month, might feel unnecessary. User experiences and opinions. I've heard from a lot of users who made the switch to ChatGPT+. Some say it's worth every penny. They rely on it for work or study and need that speed. Others though find that the free version is enough for their needs. So it really comes down to how much you're using it and what for. Here are some bonus tips for you. Before we wrap up, here are a few extra tips to get the most out of your ChatGPT experience, whether you're on the free or paid version. Stay updated on features. OpenAI often releases updates, so keep an eye out. Even free users sometimes get access to new tools, and you'll be ready to use them as soon as they're out. Optimize your prompts. No matter which version you use, crafting detailed prompts can lead to better results. Experiment with how you ask questions to get the most accurate responses. Consider your needs. Remember, ChatGPT Plus is a monthly subscription, so think about whether you'll use the extra features enough to justify the cost. If you're someone who uses ChatGPT daily or for work, Plus might be the way to go. So in the end, who should consider upgrading? If you're a student, professional, or anyone who needs quick, reliable responses and early access to new features, ChatGPT Plus might be a great investment for you. Casual users, the free version should be plenty. Thanks for sticking around. If this video helped you decide, hit that like button and subscribe to the Tutorial Lab for more tips on tech tools and AI. And tell us in the comments, are you using the free or paid version? We'd love to hear your thoughts.